Hi, I'm Jose, and I interviewed a guy named Jeremy Johnson. I met Jeremy at a place that gives food and clothing to people and families in need. We became friends after a few conversations, and I learned he loves music like I do. We've even had a few singing battles. I learned he's a music artist. He used to be a manager at several grocery stores. And Jeremy became homeless after his wife passed away and he lost his job. Some of us are one paycheck away from being homeless. We all know that mental health is at an all time high. So join me in this journey where I'll talk to Jeremy up close and personal and try to gain some insight into why mental health is so rampant today, why it's not being studied enough. And finally, if we don't get a handle on it and take it seriously, every community is not only going to continue to be affected, but we are going to pay a heavy price for it. Hi, I'm Jeremy Johnson. Where are you from? Um, I'm from Fort Worth, Texas. Were you, um, were you raised in Fort Worth? Yeah, I was, I was raised in Fort Worth. What's your education? Like, have you been in high school? What high school did you go to? Oh, well, I mean, I went to Heights, Arlington Heights High School. Yeah, I was, I was, I, I, gradu uh, I uh, graduated in 12th grade. My living situation right now is, you know, I'm trying to get housing. I'm going through the motions. Everything is uh, everything is a waiting process right now. I uh, I went to DRC and try to try to get my uh, housing and uh, but they're 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 waiting. They got a they got a waiting list that that I have to I have to go. I I have to wait until they're you know they have appropriate uh, things for me to you know to, uh, to tell me that uh, for me that. Uh, I have my housing or something like that. Uh, I recently tried to apply for a job, and you know, they they had other candidates that you know they filled in the job before me. So, so I'm, I'm still waiting on that, you know. And it's other situations that's going on with me, and you know, it's a, it's, it's it's a lot of things that that's that's going on. So now you're you're technically homeless, is yeah. that what? Yes, I'm homeless. I'm homeless. So what do you so what do you sleep at? I sleep out on the I sleep out on the streets. You say the streets like a, a, a dance. Uh, I know some people sleep like by a door, like at the church or a building where it's lit up. Yeah, I sleep I sleep at a, a bench or either a church. Okay. Yeah. Which yeah. yeah. ones do you mind? Yeah. The yeah. Uh, I sleep I sleep on a, a bench. You know. It, uh, sometimes I sleep on these benches up here. You what know, locations? Uh, like. Uh, oh, sometimes I go, sometimes I go uh, behind this building and then sleep on the benches out back here, or I go, or I go to the uh, to Main Main Street and I uh, sleep sleep behind the buildings. So when you say Main Street, can you describe to me what's on Main Street? Like what's over there? Is it? It's a it's apartments. A, it's yeah, a it's a lot. It's a lot of a lot of restaurants, residents, and apartments and stuff. Stuff, some places where you can go and lay your head down. Sometimes they have, they have little, uh, ban uh, uh, they have little benches in the back. You know, where they, you know, you can sleep. You can sleep in the back of the bench. You so know. Why, why do you pick here? Why do you pick here in Main Street? Because it's closest to the, all, all the places that I go to. I gotta, I gotta stay, stay in the area where I'm, where, where I'm close to. You know what? Or you know, cause sometimes I don't have bus fare. Sometimes I don't have this money or something like this resources. So I have to, I have to, I have to, I have to stay close where I can. It's walking distance. You know, I can go, I can go to Broadway or I can go to Crossroads. All those, are, all these places are close, closest to that, 
closest to Maine. You know, and this right. this place over here is closest to Maine. All you have to do is just walk behind this building, and it's 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 right there. Yeah. So you know, when you say crossroads and Broadway, for those that are not from here and don't know, those are those are churches that yeah, you go to for help. They 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 provide aid for you and provide food for you, clothes and clothes and everything. Clothes they provide clothes. They could buy uh, food, food pantry, uh, sack lunches, and everything. You know, they provide everything. Just, just like Crossroads, they, they do the same thing. You have, they have certain days and dates that you have to do. You have to, uh, uh, you have to look at their schedules and go up there. You know, at, at, at times, at times you, sometimes you can't make it. Sometimes you can. You know, but you know, you have to alternate, alternate between all these uh, churches and stuff that. That help you out and and bring 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 you that's that that that's that's there for you you know that's that's uh they okay. help you out your city resources i got you yeah. and what about what about safety are, are these places more safe that, that you're picking or are they yeah yes they they're they're they're, they're more safe now because they all they all have a, a, a police officer in hand and you know and the police officer diverts the the uh the bad the bad uh situations from happening but if this is no police there then that that's 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 a problem you know the places that you're sleeping at yeah you know, are those places more safe than others are you picking most places to yeah i know, pick i place? pick places more places that that are that are safe that has a lot of cops around have ambassadors or something like that something somebody's walking around around uh you know that that you know that can uh, divert the uh, bad attention from me. Oh, you know. How's yeah. it now being homeless or in, in between housing? I should say how how safe is it? Is it dangerous being homeless? Is it is it you know? Yeah, it's very dangerous being homeless, especially I've of, now. I've heard of people going to sleep, falling asleep, yeah. and then they wake up and their shoes are gone. Yeah. And and uh, and that's and that's practically every day and every night. You're gonna, you're gonna if if you if you if if you don't have your stuff up under your head or or or, or covered up, come covered up or in your pockets, it will it will become up missing the next day. Uh, you 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 won't have no phone, no nothing, because it ain't it's no. Uh, it's no honor amongst thieves, man. It's just, they, 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 they steal, they steal anything. You know, you're pretty alert. Yeah, you're pretty, pretty alert. So I've known you for some time. Yeah, I appreciate you giving me this interview. Uh, well, started to get to know you because you come through a crossroads at a location that yes. I'm at, you're at, yeah. and I know that you're to yourself, and quiet, uh, and sometimes yes. just people that you know. Yes. But, but you're pretty alert. So have you ever had anything? From you taken while you been before? Uh, yes, I had I had phones taken from me from people 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 that I know friends that I know what friends I taken? Uh, phones, phones cell cell phones and cell phones and uh I, I had uh money taken from me IDs you know you and know you're just completely you're, knocked out completely completely knocked out you know it's because you know sometimes you get you get tired and you and you you're very tired because you, you you steady watching and all that stuff and sometimes you sleep sound and when you sleep sound that's when that's when the tension gets you that's I when it, that's when it comes they, that's when they, they and they follow you around and uh, especially if they think you got something that they want you know they'll 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 follow you around and they'll be lurking around looking around somewhere uh, in the in the back or, or they'll be sitting behind you or something anything just watching you you know these these people are you know are very uh, very smooth with their stealing with their with their craft they're they're, they're they, they steal to get drugs and do do other stuff with the, with the money and uh, it's it's, it's 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 just crazy out here for and especially for the ones that that don't don't do drugs and the ones that are trying to uh get out of this situation man they making it harder for us you know what i'm saying the, the just like they say a bunch of uh, you know one bad apple destroys a bunch but it's too it's more than a lot it's more than one bad apple so you know you don't I know you're yeah. woken up to somebody trying to take your stuff 
Oh uh, no, man! It's man. They they're very crafty, man. Because if that happened, you know, I would have to get aggressive, you know. Then then with them, you know. Have you ever been? Yeah. Have you ever been married before? Oh uh, yes. Yeah. Yes. Before being homeless or after being homeless? Before him being homeless, and that's that's when that's when that's when everything started to deteriorate then from 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 2017 to now. So do you mind? Talking about it, like how did it happen? Like how did that make it hard on you? It was, and what, it, happened? Like, what happened? What happened? Man, I, I started uh, losing my job. The, the the family of the wife started turning against me, and then it's, it just stuff just started going downhill. And yeah, you know, and from there I found myself at the bottom of the barrel at Cypress Street on. What happened? What to your wife? Oh, she, she died of congestive heart failure. So you, so you were married and your wife died of congestive heart failure. So yeah. she didn't, you didn't go through the door. She wife actually passed yeah, away. Yeah, she just passed away, yeah. I'm sorry to hear that. I appreciate yeah. you sharing that information. Did you guys, where'd you guys live at when, when you worked together? Uh, Middle Brook. Oh, like in a house apartment house, with family? Yeah. House, or, yes. Like where had you worked at before? Oh, I worked at a, a numerous jobs. Uh, 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 contracting for uh, for a for a, a, a supplying company of of uh, sterilizing sterilizing uh, sterilizing products for uh, hospitals. Yeah, sterilizing products for hospitals. So you worked as a contractor sterilizing products for hospitals. Yes. What yes. else? What else have you worked? For? I work for uh, Albertsons, Walmart, Kroger, Tom Thumb. All of them. What were your positions in the grocery stores? Uh, um, I was uh, some some of them. I was stocker. Some of them. I was uh, a manager. Yeah. Uh, not, yeah, night manager. Night manager. Mostly, most of the time, I was a, a night manager. Yeah. So some of you had a pretty pretty, pretty good job. Yeah, 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 pretty good job. Yeah. And uh, uh, Tom Thumb was 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 one of my best ones because that's where I received uh, big bonuses. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I remember before when we, when we have been talk, have talked, you mentioned to me about hanging out in downtown and yeah. city streets and yeah. different locations. So you're from here, you grew up here? Yes, I grew up here. I know, I know, I know around, I know around, all around here, you know, all around the south side. That's where I used, that's where I used to stay on, you know, over there, Bessie, Hattie, all those, all, the, all those places over there, Terrell, all those places. Some people, after they lose a spouse or yeah. lose a job, yeah. they move to another state. Yeah. What has kept you here in Fort Worth? What has kept you from moving somewhere else? Or have you done it before? Uh -huh. I, I, yeah, I was. I tried to do it before. You know, I, I went to. Uh, I, I was going to go to uh, California and move out there, and uh, but I didn't. Uh, I didn't end up going. Uh, and and uh, but I had a lot of people. Uh, lie to me and tell me you know they was gonna they was gonna help me with my uh with my music and all that stuff i was you know i was gonna go to atlanta and i was gonna stay in atlanta oh, wow. so but you know but uh i went out there and the guy the guy didn't show up so oh wow yeah so i had so i had I, I, I just started i started to stay but i i ended up coming back so what do you yeah. mean about your music what, what, music what, i what i you, you I, I uh I rap, sing, and and, and I, 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 I I do the whole nine. Okay. Yeah. So you rap, you sing. Yeah, I rap and sing, and I uh, I, I write music, I write poems, and I do I do multiple things. And I've heard you sing. You're pretty gifted. Yeah. You have yeah. a real sharp memory. You yes. remember a lot of songs. Uh, yes. So uh, yeah, I know you. You're pretty gifted at that. Yes. Can you play any instruments? Uh, no instruments. No okay. instruments. Been formally trained in music, like ever had like singing classes or yeah, like that, singing or? classes? No, no singing classes. Just, kind of self -talk? I just yeah, self taught. If you were to go back and tell yourself something back twenties, back when you were younger, what, what would you what would you tell yourself, or what would you change? Man, I would uh, I would change a lot of things. I would change a lot of things about myself. I would I would I would uh, I would I would I would, I would if I knew what I knew now, I would be a leader, not a follower. And and you know, so much, so much then, you know, I was being a follower instead of a leader. 
and I was letting people put me in situations where, you know, I could have been better off than what I am, you know, you know, I could have played football or something like that, or I could have did something other than what I was doing, uh, the stuff that I was doing, the situations that I would put myself in, because, you know, I'm, I'm falling behind somebody else. But whatever you do in your life, be a leader. Don't be a follower. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so you succumb to peer pressure too? Yeah, so yeah. Peer succumb, yeah, peer so pressure, 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 yes, yes, yes. I remember growing up, that was a big thing. Yeah, yeah. Was, yeah. I yeah. Middle school and high school, it was yeah. peer pressure. Peer pressure. Say no to drugs. Yes, yes, yeah, everything yeah, like yeah, that. Everything like that, yes. If you don't mind me asking, was drugs a part of making some of those bad decisions in the past? Uh, no, not really, because I, I uh, only uh, smoke weed and, and drink. You know, you know some some things. You know, I I, I, I kind of got bad with. You know, with the drinking uh, sometimes. But you know, I learned to uh, control it. I learned mm -hmm. to, to control it. You know, control everything that I was 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 doing. My situations. I would learn to. Just, just, just like I'm doing right now, I stay away from trouble. I stay away from people that's, 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 that's doing trouble. That's doing things that's, that's gonna, that's gonna put me in a, a bad situation, which is in jail or something like that. that that's, you know, that's what's amazing to me is that, yeah, is that we think that staying out of trouble has to do with just like when you're young. Yeah. When you're in high school. No. Like for me, I also went on to college. Yeah. But you're saying that even. As as a grown as a grown as a grown being man, being you still you still yeah you still have to uh, being grown. yeah you have to still be uh, stay uh, keep your distance from people. There are people still yeah. that still, 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 still you yeah dissociate yourself from them them people that that's doing that's still that's still yeah yeah and they try to put you in the position where you to, to make you make those same decisions yeah. So, so the only thing is you to do is to be smart and say, uh, say no, you know, pretty, pretty much say no. It's, 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 man, I don't, no, I don't do that. I don't, man, I don't, I don't do that stuff. You, uh, that's you, that's you, you know, I, mean? I, I don't, uh, I don't knock you for doing what you do, but this is what I do. This, yeah, this is how I address my situation. This is how I, if you could have. Yeah. Today, if you could have a wish, just uh, something that would help you out today, what would that be? What would, in your mind, what would help you better your situation? Man, man, that is the question of the day because that, I mean, right, right now, you know what I'm saying, all I would need is, a, is like a motel, like for a month or so. You know, somebody just to help me out, and you know, put, put yeah, somebody to help me out, some, uh, somebody to, you know, you know, cause I know, I know people don't want you to stay, stay with them or something, cause they feel like, you know, you might steal or something, or you, or you like the other people, you know what I'm saying? A lot of bad apples has messed it up for other, other, other people, do, uh, doing, doing bad stuff. Well, I know, yeah. I know, motel. You mentioned that to me before, and we've had casual conversations. Yeah. I know motel would help you out a night or two or three, but what would help, what do you think, you know, if somebody could give you a wish, you know, would it be a certain amount of money? Would it be going back to college? Would it be a certain type of job? Would it be a car? Yeah. You know, give me the whole package, you know, other than the motel room. Other than the motel room? Oh. Uh, if, if somebody was to, uh, to bless me, you know, with a with a with a financial uh, blessing, and and, and that was a, a, be a sponsor to me or something like that, I would uh, start my ministry. You know, I have a I wanted to start up a, a palm ministry where I can uh, where I can write my palms, and you know, I can I can I can venture out to other people that you know anybody that that. You know anybody that wants to, you know, help me run it. You know they can, they can, they can be, they can be the side decisions and stuff. You know, and I, I can, I can be the, you know, the main person because, you know, I, the one that uh, thought of my, my palm ministry and, uh, and um, I want, uh, and I, I, I feel like, you know, I had a lot of good poems. I had a lot of good poems. You know, one lady gave me three hundred dollars for. 
uh, grace be found. So, so and 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 that's and that's 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 good for a person, you know. Just you know, hey, I, hey, God, hey, God gave me the insight to make these palms and stuff, and I can, I can really do, I can really, I'm I'm really talented. So, so it's I'm I'm really blessed. I can I I can just freestyle right now and make something else, you know. And that's and that's 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 how I've been that's how I've been given. That's what I've been given my 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 my, my freestyle, and uh, God bless me with that. And uh, and and that's that's what really what I need uh, right now is a big sponsor. So you mentioned before you know, we had a conversation the other day. And you mentioned the ribeye steak. So mm -hmm. I think people think that because people are homeless or people are. Financially not able. And yeah, they that, think they're they're, they're not. What they desire what they like, what they want change. It's less. It's less. Yeah. Different. So with that yeah. being said, no, it's not less. They, you they still you still crave a ribeye steak. Yeah, we still crave. Uh, you still desire to be in, in a relationship. Yeah, in a relationship and in a in a, a, a marriage. I, I still okay. desire to be in a relationship. I still desire to be in a marriage. I still desire to have a good job. I still desire to have a good a car. I still desire all these other things that everybody else has. You know, I, it's just it's just only thing is I've been I've been labeled. I've been labeled as this person that you know gave given up or done doing this. But it's just situations that that. Just kept kept me in the quicksand. It's really okay. There, there, was a, there was a lady yeah. at Crossroads the other day that she pushes a cart. She wears the the biker shorts. She wears the glasses. Yes. Uh, she's always been respectful to me when I when I'm there. Yes. Uh, working. And I was totally surprised when you revealed to me that y'all dated. Yes. So, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. so y'all dated. I was yes. surprised. I was yeah. like, wow. So yeah. so even being homeless, even being in a different place in your life, yeah. you know, you do still yeah, crave, crave, and talk to people, attention, you still have yes. relationships, yeah, you relationships. still do things, yes, okay. so still, still have, still have friendships, you know, stuff, stuff that comes up, and you know, it's, 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 it's an, it's a, it's a usual thing, it's, 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 a, it's a thing, it's a thing that happens, that happens, and. You know, we, we, we learn from our mistakes and we, we, we see what was we see the people that are that are real with us and the people that are fake. And you know, you, you know, that's why you gotta you gotta you gotta pay attention to your red flags. Your there's, red flags. There's some yeah. there's some people that I noticed that they go to places like Crossroads which is a community yeah. resource place that like we talked about earlier, for those that don't know, they they give we give our food, yeah. clothing, yeah. and there's resources there for people that, yeah. that need them. Yeah. And I noticed that some people come in just to socialize. So how yeah. important is that? How important is that to you? Being yeah. able to come to a place or just you know being by yourself. So so do you? It's it's very important because it, it gives you a chance to get out of the 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 critical situations that's going outside the heat, the. Uh, the, it, it, it alternately changes. You one one minute is is hot, one minute is raining, hailing too, with the same with the same combined. How do you uh, when, you, when, you, when, when those places are closed? Where do you go to go talk to people? Uh, um, you don't. We don't. I don't go nowhere to talk to people. I, you know, I kind of like stay to myself because a lot of people are. Are about bringing drama and all that stuff. You like you you get to know them, and then all of a sudden you thought you knew them, and then you do, and then this person change on you. So I, I get that, but I've yeah. seen I've seen people that are on the streets. Yes. Like I said earlier, walk through downtown. Yeah, and they talk to people while they're walking by, coming in and out of a restaurant, out of a business. Yeah, they do make conversations. They sit yeah. on the bench. People yeah. might sit on the bench just yeah. to eat a sandwich while on their break. Yeah. And so I do notice that people do find a way to talk. Yeah, 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 so yeah, they do. Yeah, they socialize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, yeah, they find situations to talk around here. It's, 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 it's a lot of people, nice people. Still, 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 some good, some some good people that'll talk to you and uh, give you some advice and give you some encouragement. What would you be doing now if, if you could pick? 
Look, what career, what job, what would you be doing right now? Oh, if I, if, if I had my choice, I would, I would, I would have my record label or something. I would, uh, that, that would, that was, that was my dream, you know, to, to go into business administration, get my, uh, get my masters and all, and all my, uh, Music. My craft, music yeah, man, man, yeah, music, music. yeah, music is my passion. Yeah, yeah. 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 My favorite places to go is the crossroads because I love to see Jose and me. We love to we communicate and we talk and we we sing together and you know what I'm saying. We always. That's that's my favorite place to go because you know, cause cause he 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 makes me happy. He makes me happy when I go there. And every time every time we every time we get together, we 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 we, we thinking about a song to play. We thought about going on American Idol and all that stuff. We thought about doing other things together. You know what I'm saying? That collaborating together and singing together with yeah. And and so and so so being being with Jose is is, is kind of like the best thing that happened to me, you know. Yeah, cause me he's he's he's, he's, he's kind he's my friend, you know. That's that's my friend. That's my friend. So and and uh, I just wanted to put that in with you you when you sung with us too. That that was but that was harmonized. good. That we we harmonized together, Morning. man. That was that was good. Morning. That was more. That was good too. Well, this is Magnum Opus. I'm Melinda. This is Jeremy. That's Jose behind the camera. Um, and we're going to say, hey, this ends our session today, but we will be coming to you with more from Jeremy, some more songs, and all of that. So we're going to wrap this up for today. Thank you again for your time and everything. You know we'll see you yes. at the crossroads. Yes. Get it on.